I'm Dominique Lavigne, your Bakersfield neighborhood reporter. Welcome to Carl's Jr. What can we get started for you today? Pulling through the drive through at Carl's Jr. might be a little different now that they introduced a new AI drive through system. It's been a month since the full launch, and employees say it's been mostly positive for the restaurant. Welcome to Carl's Jr. What can we get started for you today? Yes, this drive through is run by artificial intelligence. Sure. Would you like to make that a large combo? One month ago, the Carl's Jr. on Panama Lane became the first chain with CKE restaurants to introduce the new AI drive through system in Bakersfield. Yeah, there's more positive than negative. This comes as California fast food workers expect to see their minimum wage rates increase to $20 an hour under the recently passed Assembly Bill 1228. You know, if you look at what California has done, which is increase the minimum wage for fast food workers to $20 an hour as of April 1st, you know, we have a, uh, there, there's sort of an existential problem for a lot of restaurant owners. Axel Arcos, one of the shift leaders at Carl's Jr. says, regardless of how much he makes, he's good, as long as he has a job. At the end of the day, I need money. <laughs> I feel like everyone does. When I asked Gupta how he sees the new AI technology will impact jobs for local fast food workers, he says the technological advancements can take a job from someone who would work at the drive through but he believes it would open up new job opportunities and increase efficiency. I think what you're actually doing is you're enabling the human beings who are in the restaurants uh, who are still working there to be more productive and to be more valuable for the restaurant. There we go, boss. Sorry, by the way. No, I good. put two ranches in there for you. Thank you, boss. Thank you, boss. Have a good one. Gupta adds the new system will help make customers happier, too. Many people have this challenge where they go through the drive through you know, you order a burger, you don't want pickles, you end up with a burger with pickles. You know, the idea is that, you know, technology system is just going to have a much higher rate of consistency. Arcos tells me for the most part, the new system helps him work better. For me, it's been helpful. But since it's still early in the launch, he's dealt with some problems. Like there's been problems where someone said that there was like a $70 order and he's like, I only wanted a burger. For now, they're still working out some of the kinks, but Artcos emphasizes the problems are minor compared to the positive response from customers. Issues, because if I'm taking an order and it has an issue, now I gotta take two at once. Carl's Jr. employees advise customers to be patient with the new system and say that it will continue to learn and improve as it's used. For 23ABC News, I'm Dominique Lavigne, your Bakersfield neighborhood reporter.